In this video, you'll learn how to use JQL to find issues with text-based fields. Text-based fields are elements in an issue with fields where you can enter text values such as description or summary. There are four operators available for searching in text fields. The contains operator. The does not contain operator. The is operator and the is not operator. You can use the contains operator to locate issues by searching for any word or phrase that appears within an issue summary, description, comments, or custom text fields. Let's try this out. For example, say you wanted to locate all the issues across your projects that relate to finance reports. Select Search from the main navigation bar, then Advanced Issue Search. This takes you to the Issue Search page. To see the advanced search in JQL, select Switch to JQL. Type the field's summary. You'll see a suggestion for the available elements based on the field you've typed. In this case, select the Contains Operator. Next, type the text you want to search for. Using quotation marks, type Finance Report. You can press the Enter key from your keyboard or click on the search button to run the query. Jira will now display the list of issues that have the text Finance Report in the summary field. Using double quotation marks will return issues that are either exact matches or fuzzy matches. Words that are almost the same but a little different. In our example, Jira has returned the fuzzy matches financed and financing. You will always need to use double quotation marks for text searches with more than one word and for certain reserved words like a, an, any, are. Don't worry about memorizing reserved words. Jira will show an error message when a reserved word is not in quotes. If you want an exact text match, you'll need to amend your search slightly. Let's try this out. For example, say you want to locate an issue with a description containing the exact phrase, figures for March 2022. Clear your JQL text box. Type the field description and use autocomplete to select the contains operator. Then type in your quotation marks slash figures for March 2022 slash. The slashes tell Jira to search for these exact words in this exact order. The first quotation mark is for entering text to match. The second quotation mark is used to specify an exact match. You can either select search or keep adding to your query. Select search. Jira will now display issues where the description contains the exact phrase, figures for March 2022. What if you want to search for a word or phrase that appears in any text field in an issue? In this case, you can use text as a field. For example, say you wanted to find all issues related to a crash in a project called Lima. Clear your JQL text box. Type the field, text, add the contains operator or tilde symbol from your keyboard, and then the word crash. Select search. Jira will now show you issues that have the word crash in any of their text fields. The text value is non-case sensitive. This means that even when we change crash to uppercase, Jira will search using the same text. There are more ways to search with text using the is and is not operators. You can pair the is and the is not operators with empty to find issues where a text field is or is not populated. Let's try this out. For example, let's say you need to find all issues that don't have a description. Clear your JQL text box. Type description. Add the operator is and the keyword empty. Jira will now return all issues that don't have a description. 
Or let's say you have a custom text field called stakeholder summary. And you want to find issues where that field has been populated. Clear your JQL text box. Use the autocomplete feature to add the custom text field, stakeholder summary. Add the operator is not and the keyword empty. Select search. Jira will now show you all issues where the custom text field stakeholder summary contains text. To recap, you can search with exact or similar text to find issues based on words or phrases within there, summaries, descriptions, comments, or custom text fields. The operator you use will determine whether Jira includes or excludes the specific text or field value you're looking for.